Hallelujah, Bishop. Bishop, we just thank God for breakthrough that we have power over all the works of the enemy. Um, Bishop, this, this sister came all the way from Ipswich. She comes with her sisters, Bishop, once in a while. But basically what happened is yesterday they were in Ipswich and they were all talking about how they're going to come to the Kingdom Church today. And she was the only one out of all of them that didn't want to come. She was saying, mm, let me just think. I don't know. I'll, I'll decide in the morning. I don't really know. So anyway, she ended up getting dressed, but she was just feeling the whole, the whole ride over. It's about three hours, two, three hours. She was having this massive headache, feeling like throwing up. She was having motion sickness, everything, Bishop, even up to the, the moment that she was inside the church. But Bishop, she just thanks God for breakthrough because as she sowed her seed today, you spoke over her life and you said, because you came today and you sowed that seed, now your entire destiny has been released. So we just thank God for the anointing that is upon your life, Bishop. Because just from her taking that step of faith, it was obvious that the, en the enemy didn't want her to come today. And now, how are you feeling your head? Clear. Huh? clear. The head is clear. Yes, but... Somebody say, praise the Lord here right now. So by her just stepping up, can you imagine she was refusing to come? Yes, now, how much more is it to take 50 pounds out? If she was refusing to come, how much more hard is it now to get the 50 pounds out of our bag and so I think that was the last straw on the devil's back. Shout hallelujah here right now. Uh, Bishop, another thing about this miracle salt. Yes. You know, Bishop, she's been, um, she had her, her, her driving license from Florida, so she had to get it converted over in, in here in, in the UK. So she's been going with the instructor every time doing the lessons. But Bishop, every time she says the man was just so mean to her. Just opening up his mouth, just completely evil towards her, Bishop. The driving instructor. Yes, Bishop. Uh -huh. Every single time. She didn't know what the problem was. So she decided to take the miracle salt. The, and last time, the last time that she went with the instructor, she, as she sat in the car, she just kind of sprinkled it on the ground of the car without the instructor knowing. And she said from that moment, his entire attitude, his entire demeanor has completely changed. Now he's laughing with her, telling jokes. Everything is fine, Bishop. After sprinkling the miracle, miracle salt. box is shutting the lion's mouth. Somebody say hallelujah. If somebody's mean to you, while they're looking like this, throw the miracle salt on them. Shout hallelujah. Now the instructor is even joking with you. Yes, we drive along because I can drive. So it was just going through the motions. But every time, because he knew I could drive, he was a bit kind of offish, you know, kind of mean and talking to me aggressive. And I would talk back to him aggressive. But after our two hour ride i would leave with a headache and i say to myself i'm not going back with him again but then i was talking to my sister patricia and i told her i know what i'm gonna do because i already anoint my hands with oil when i go so i said i'm when i go i'm gonna have a pinch of salt in my hands as soon as i get in the car i'm gonna throw the salt down before i started and i started to do that about two three times now and his whole demeanor has changed he is so nice so relaxed he doesn't keep that foot on that little pedal, which annoys me, you know. <laughs> he just laugh and joke, and we just go around for two hours just driving along, you know. So, I think I'm... So, sure. now he does not put that foot on that no, pedal. Not on that little pedal, that annoying little pedal, yeah. He doesn't stop me like that, you know. He just lets me drive, because he knows I can drive. But I think because there's nothing to teach me, you know, that's like... I don't know if he's annoyed with that, but he was just being so mean. And I thought, I'm going to fix you. I'm going to dash some salt in your car. So from that point on, our two-hour lesson and the rest of the day, you're going to be anointed. <laughs> Come on, lift up your hands right now. The, make sure you get your miracle pack. Lift up your hands right now. Lord, we give you praise. Lord, I thank you. Keep sorting them out. 